Hey everybody, it's Kevin with American Tackle Live Question and Answer. Glad to be back right now. I know we missed a week. Uh, we were actually up doing some stuff. Um, I'm joined today by the one and the only Alex Funky. How are you, Alex? Good. How are you? Doing well. We spent some time together. We did. We had a little bit of an excursion, which is why you guys didn't have a live uh, on the last one, because we were in Georgia. Yep. We were filming some stuff that you'll see soon. Can't really talk about it just yet, but I have to say I am a big fan of this new product. Yeah. Be, uh, be super glad to get them here. Uh, yeah, a lot of testing, and now we're on a marketing and filming and the cool stuff. We're doing all the we're doing all the fun stuff now. Yes, which is my favorite. Yeah. Of so let's talk about the big news. Big news. Lucky number eleven. So we just ended up winning the award for best new accessory in the general and course fishing category at FTEX. Uh, if you're not aware of FTEX. It is very much like iCast for Europe in yes. most basic terms. Um, but what it is, is it is the largest international trade show over in Europe. Uh, it has been going on for almost 30 years. I didn't know this, yeah. uh, but it's Long almost time. 30 years. But they've missed a couple of years due to COVID, um, the war in Ukraine, yeah. a couple other yeah. things. Like it's, One they're getting into another. it. Yeah, but they ended up doing a digital sh uh, showcase, but it wasn't just voted on digitally. They had a whole panel of judges that came in looked at the most innovative, fit and finish, a whole lot of information yeah, that way. Actually held the product, not just online. We actually had to send it overseas, um, which is pretty cool to have somebody physically touch it and kind of go through it. Uh, and we ended up winning for our SRG. Uh, we yes. talked about SRGs at ICAST yes, quite a bit. Yep. Um, had a huge amount of love for them, excitement for them. Uh, and the reason Alex is joining us today is Alex has been kind of the You've been kind of the champion for these things. So tell me a little bit, just briefly, about the SRGs. So basically, it's going to be a wind-style grip, but you can actually change out what the grip looks like. So uh, if you joined us at iCast, you saw these guys. Yep. These were the fully built that actually Funky built. I did. <laughs> um, so this is going to be the black. So um, it's actually a shrink tube, if you're not familiar with, uh, with the product. Um, so it kind of conforms to any but shape. It's, but it's not just about that. No. It's not just about any shape. It's not just about it being a uh, shrink tube. The cool thing about it, here, you hold that one. I'll hold this one. And I'll start bringing more in, is the ability to customize in colors and in patterns. I'm just going to keep pulling more and more of these. You got to hold that one. I'll hold this one. Okay. Here, I'll hold these two. Okay, there you go. So the cool thing about it is these are going to come in a lot of different uh, patterns, a lot of different colors, and the benefit of this is it gives not only the custom rod builder the ability to customize on the fly, Yes. Uh, it gives anglers the ability to customize after the fact. So say you buy a rod with the SRGs on them, you could then change out the color because maybe you want your red to be your flipping stick. You your could. blue could be your 
you know, your crankbait rod. Like there's a ton of different abilities to do something like this. Yes. So we're gonna go ahead and put these away. If you guys wanna find out more about these, there's a link in the description. Um, but I think we have something chalked up real quick. It's gonna be the video that we showed at iCast. I'll take more of these. So Doug, without, uh, without hesitation, what, what's the phrase? Further ado. Further ado, thank you, sir. Without further ado, Doug, take it away. So that was the SRGs. SRGs. Awesome, what you guys saw was, one, the video showed at iCast, and the second one was the install video. Yep. Uh, super simple. Easy. It's not rocket scientist. No. <laughs> um, one cool thing that we're actually really excited about it is this is our 11th award. Yes. And you've been here for a couple. I haven't been here for that many. Well, I've been here yes. for this one. Yes. So how awesome does that feel? Oh, it feels really good. It's nice to be understood that we are innovating, and this is this is something that we've been working on for a while. Yep, it went through cast, obviously. Yeah, it went through how many iterations? Uh, quite a few. So. I did a lot of cutting and a lot of <laughs> tube shrinking. So. We were putting bait on them All kinds to make of. sure it didn't have issues. Yep. So they're pretty full, full foul proof, full proof, full proof, full proof. Uh, you know, so they're super exciting for anybody that wants a tackier style grip um, that. If it does lose your so-called tackiness, uh, just cut it off and replace it. And go back to work. I am a big fan of how, like, how you can customize it. Yeah. And then we're we're still finalizing a couple of things. I know we're <clears> going <throat> to get this question because we've been getting this question since iCast. Is when they're coming out? When yes. they're coming out? When can I order them? Because we have a lot of people that are super excited about this. Yep. We are still finalizing a couple of the pieces as far as how they're going to be coming out of um, the warehouse how we're gonna add different pieces on here for different textures and different colors. Trim options. Uh, and we also have to look at it, because what you guys might see is we do a lot of uh, you know, custom rod builder products, yeah. but we also do is a lot of OEM yes. and, and major company stuff. So we're figuring out a couple of nuances with that. So these should be hopefully here either late Q1, early Q2, I think is yep. what we're shooting for. Yep. Um, but if you are interested in them, we do have the link on the description, or you can check them out on the website. AmericanTackle.us. Just type in SRG, or Patrick has been awesome and put a big banner with the awesome emblem of us winning yeah. on there. So just click that link. You can see some more info there. So let's move down. Um, next thing I kind of want to talk about is the new 2022 fall release. Yes. Uh, we've done this completely different yep. than we normally do. Um, there's what, 40 new products? 40. At Probably least? Is, yeah, at least. Um, a couple of things that we did show at iCast. Um, let's pull some of this stuff out. Yep. So we've got the CRS DTs. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna take away your pet. I'm taking away your baby. I'm okay. sorry. I'm putting it away. That's fine. <laughs> okay. 
But we have the CRSDTs. Tell me a little bit about the CRSDTs. So they are a trigger style barrel seat, um, cushion hoods uh, available in black and silver, size 20 through uh, 24. Um, they will be good for jigging rods. Um, you know, uh, I think the West Coast is going to really like these a lot. Yeah, West Coast. I mean, jigging rods, bottom rods, uh, that sorts of stuff. Um, definitely, uh, we need it. Uh, oh, we've had. I mean, we've had the CRSDTs or the CRSDs forever for a while, yeah. and we've been asked. I mean, for trigger. as long as I can remember. Yeah. When is a trigger? When is a trigger? When is a trigger? And yep. you guys have to know. Is we go through a very extensive process to develop products, to test them. To I mean, we've. Sure, this, is, is, it, it this is probably the 30th iteration of this that we finally like just nailed down to where it's comfortable in the hand. Yeah. It's tough enough to deal with some of that big heavy jigging and, and it looks good. Yeah. You know, it's got to look good. Yeah. Uh, another thing that we had, we'll pull these away. Again, if you guys want to find out more information about this, we have a link to our new catalog in the description as well. So if you want to check that out and see all 40 plus brand new products. Um, now these are available to buy. Yes. If you have They're an account here, with us, ready to go. Or if you want an account with us, yeah. Or find our local, your best distributor that you'd yeah. like to buy from. We've got well, like Mudhole, HFF, Voodoo, Voodoo. Yeah. There's yeah. there's so many. We've got a dealer list on the on the website too. Yep. So so maybe you don't have a business and you can't buy direct from us and you want to purchase these, send an email. What's your email by the way? Alex Funky at American Tackle dot us. So you N K E. So if you want to find out more information, send. Uh, the funky a really good email and let yes. him ask him hey i saw you on the live and i want to see more of the dealer list so these are the new vertus uls now we've been messing with these for a minute yes uh these are super popular die cast yep uh, a lot of people have been looking for this frame style uh in black um, but we're doing it in raw titanium yep and then we're also looking at a possible other color uh, there may be a few maybe maybe yep. And, so uh, chrome too, obviously. Oh, chrome as well. Yep. So, so tell me a little bit about the ULs. Uh, the cool thing about these, um, it's actually a little bit thicker gauge than what some people may be used to, um, which is obviously going to add strength uh, and durability. Um, obviously available in 316 stainless steel, black and chrome, um, and then full titanium, nanolite and duralite, and also available in black titanium or black diamond finish. I was about to say, this has got our black diamond finish on it. Yes. So. Yeah. Really popular finish. We have the Black Diamond on the oh, British XHDs. Oh, we actually won an award in China for we Black Diamond. We did. Look, look at us winning awards yeah. all over the place. Um, another thing is going to be the new G2 assembled seats. Yes. Now, this I think is probably going to be the most exciting for custom rod builders. And it's because we've had these G2 seats that have had inserts in them for ever since G2 came out. 2018 probably. I'd say. Super popular seat, but one of the all, biggest... All of them. One of the biggest complaints that we've ever heard was it's kind of a pain in the butt in the butt to glue the inserts. Yes. Well, we fixed that for you. We did it for you. Yes. So all of these are going to, if you order the Assemble G2 seats, they will come pre-glued. Pre-glued. Uh, it'll be 1K, 3K, Mat 3K, and Bushido. So all the inserts. All the inserts. And they come in CCT. They're in your the normal... Rainbow. Regular, nylon. regular finish, um, UHL hoods, the standard hoods, like literally all of the G2 combinations. And split seats. And they're coming in split seats as well, which is nice because I've done a split seat and just getting it lined up correctly is kind of a pain. It is. But them, but them already being done Where makes a lot, it, it speeds up the process. Yep. It takes all the guesswork out because you would just install this like a, a standard seat, like a PC. Yeah. Yep. This maybe isn't an insert. Tape arbor or foam arbor, whichever you prefer. Um, taper up a little bit of glue and and so I've got the catalog pulled up right here so if you guys check out the catalog it has a list of everything in here but we've got let's see just on the G2 assembled seats because of you G2 fans out there we've got the blade we've got the razor the Bravo 2 vibe 2 Bravo 2 uh, apex hang on I'm not done yet uh, the E seat the vibe the vibe 2 and the wave. Yep. Like it, it, it's all the most. I mean, it's pretty much all of the inserts. Yes. Yeah, every one of them. So, and then the other thing too is you guys want to check out more of these products. Um, there's some RFT in here. We've got new uh, winding and seat checks yep. that are rubberized. Um, yeah. So the ones that are a little bit longer, uh, tapered up to size 16 real seat. And you can just those. thread up over top of them if you want to. You could, but yeah, most of the time it'd just be for the rubber winding check for the the front of the uh, the barrel there. So. 
see, this is why we keep them around. The guy knows way more than I can ask for. It. Um, we've got some new guides in here, the Salvo guides. Um, change of stuff, the Virtus ULs are in here. I'm just literally flipping through the catalog. So if you're doing this at home as well, you're following along. Um, new tie forged, we've yeah. got the new 40s. Yeah, uh, higher 40s. So we carry the 40 low, uh, typically used more in the carp market. Uh, we had some Florida guys over here asking for sailfish pitch rods and uh, some jigging rods and things like that. So we brought in a regular 40 uh, available in polished black, black titanium, titanium, nanolite, and duralite for those, so. It's not like we don't have options. Plenty. <laughs> if anybody ever asks us, like, why don't we have an option on something, I'm just gonna be like, what are you looking at? I'd say one through 96 in the catalog, and there's plenty of them. Yep. Uh, we've got some EVA. I know EVA, EVA is not the, the, the greatest looking thing sometimes, but yep. we have got a lot of questions about styles, yes. shapes, tapers. Yep. Uh, we've got some new hoods. Uh, if you guys go through again, yeah. go through the website. There's tons. We've got some of the X cross straight grips. Yeah, I actually use those for some bass rods. Actually, some longer grip. I cut them in half, so like a uh, I don't know, maybe a 14 or 15 inch swim bait rod, cut it in half. Have a small split grip. Um, we've got stuff for slow pitch, stuff for arrow seats, uh, full. Flip that back. I'm not. So I, yeah, I know. Um, <laughs> some just shaped casting. Uh, Casting grips, some new butt grips. Um, so definitely, Don and I spent some time. Oh, the EVA adapter for the G2 handles, which so, is awesome. So if you don't like an arrow seat, which we'll not even get into that, <laughs> but if you like Can the you G2, not like those G2 handles, we made an adapter that's a small. I don't know. It's probably about a half inch long EVA piece that yep. slides down that you can actually use with other spinning seats besides the arrow now. So and we had a lot of people ask for some of this stuff where it was. Yeah. We're, we do listen to you guys. If, if there's something that you're looking for, something if you, you something you need, it's, something we're missing, let us know. Yeah, we're, we're very we, we like to take pride that not only are we here for rod builders and everybody pretty much in this building is a rod builder. Yep. But we love our rod builders. Yep. We have 45 minute conversations with each with rod builders. We, yep. we go through stuff. Mo will sit up front for two and a half hours and hang out with rod builders and just talk shop. Yep. Or just talk about like where things are biting with yeah. what's what he's fishing with um let's see do we i don't know if we touched it all like there's so much new stuff in the catalog um we're really excited about this uh oh the aw3s uh yeah we got some new aw3s 20, 20 through 24 uh it's like an aluminum saltwater window seat uh it's got a carbon insert in it a little bit um i would say it's like super heavy duty but Heavy duty enough to inshore definitely some of your light onshore yeah. applications, cobia, um, tarpon. And it's a nice um, color set. I yeah, like yeah, the silver. A, so it's like a frosted center. silver yeah. uh, matte insert and then some black hardware on it. So just if you went with the black or silver theme, it would match. Um, and then the E seat is now in CCT. Yeah, we have that. Uh, that came out, I want to say pre iCast, but uh, obviously hadn't been released yet. Uh, so CCT E seats look really nice. Um, RFT, we've got some new shrink tube, some scale, and a uh, blue colored X block. Uh, so. Which is super popular. I didn't realize how popular RFT was. Like, I know we do it with the SRGs and stuff like that, but even just we put it over our Dura grips. Yeah. One of the, those are super popular now because yep. it's it's EVA with the, the grip already installed, or and, the shrink tube already installed. And it's me. preheated, it's all set in place, so you don't have to worry about doing it yourself. Yep. Um, we got the Salva, the new Salva stuff. Um, but that kind of touches everything when it comes into catalog. Again, if you guys want to check this all out, we have some cool links in here to videos on the products. Um, the whole catalog is is linked up, so if you want to check out more on the website, you can go there. And if you're interested in purchasing, you send Funky an email and he'll get you Definitely. set up because all of the stuff in the catalog is ready to ship. Yep. So if you're looking to buy some stuff, send an email and we'll get you going. Give us a call. Absolutely. Yep. So uh, let's see. Oh, everybody's favorite time. This is Rod Building. So real quick, I want to talk about this this series. Thank you so very much. We hit 2,000 subscribers on our YouTube channel today. Did we? Which was awesome. We did. Nice. Um, but I think a lot of this is attributed to new Rod Builders checking out some new content. So um, we're really proud of this. Gary did an amazing job uh, with filming this series. We have tons more videos. I think there's like 17 or 19 like total. Yep. And we're it's already talking about... Oh, it's, it's a huge amount of time. But... We're already planning on season two okay. uh, to do even more stuff with building and stuff, but this episode is going to be pretty cool. It is how to finish like a pro, and I know this is this is you. 
anytime anybody builds anything, we, we don't show our finish to Funky because finish for Funky is is the one piece no that bubbles. you will gravitate to. No bubbles. And that's his thing, his bubbles. And Gary does a really good job in this video cool. talking about getting rid of bubbles, how to prep yourself so you don't have to worry about the bubbles, um, how to mix, apply, move it, shit. Like it's it's awesome. I. I've watched it a few times now because I get yeah. to do that. You yeah. don't. No, I don't. <laughs> so, without further ado, let's go ahead and take a uh, sneak peek at episode five of This Is Rod Building. So that is episode five, Finish Like a Pro with Gary. When is that launching? So the teaser will be up. If you just saw the teaser here, the teasers will always go up the day after. So okay. you can check out the teaser if you missed it here, if you missed the episode of this is uh, of the live show. Q and A. But always after the following week, Tuesday is at 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, we launch the full video. Cool. Um, you can go back, there's four videos up there right now. If you haven't seen the series, go check it out. Some cool you're, stuff too. Yeah, like I was, it was funny when we when we launched the first episode, and everybody was kind of watching because they wanted to see what it looked like. Because most of the company wasn't able to watch those videos because we've been crazy busy lately. But when the video went on, everybody started watching it, and you would just hear out of the corner, "Oh, I didn't even know about that. I didn't even know about this," or like, <laughs> "Oh, that's a really good tip." So even yeah. we're always learning. Like the, the cool thing about rod building is a craft. Yes. Right. Is, everybody's got tips, t tricks, techniques. Yeah, and we're we're with this show. We're gonna start bringing in more rod builders. Um, we've got a couple lined up. Some cool surprises with some people coming into town. Nice. Um, it's gonna be a really fun time, and the show has been growing because of you guys. So with that, let's uh, let's dig into some questions, some answers, and probably some really funny comments from Don. I'm sure. Because Don always has good content. So let's check it out. All right, Randy. Hey, what's going on, man? Howdy, Mike Hardiman. Ooh. Oh, Mike, <laughs> you know. Um, Daniel, what's going on? Jim Crowley, there we go. Don Morris, there he is. Hello, gents. Never fails. Uh, great stuff in the new release. You all guys are amazing. He's not lying. Yep. Um, Mike, I'm ready to build with those. <laughs> Don, again, with the content. Yeah. Order them now. Yeah. Um, and I can't, because I got to complete out my order. That's usually the hardest part, is going yes. through all that stuff. Um, dot, see, this is the content. If you don't like the arrow seat, you're wrong. I, I didn't say I didn't like it. So a lot of them. Just saying. John Graves. Hello, Pro Staffers. We've got yeah. some cool information coming about Mr. Graves. Uh, let's see. Funk is the epoxy master. Funk is the finish inspector. You are. So like that's, just, just that so is your know, thing. Just so we know, I was taught by somebody in this building who likes to write a lot of comments on I, our lives. I wonder who that is. I wonder who that is. His beard's not as good as mine. <laughs> oh, yes. Yeah. Oh, those are fighting words. We're gonna. <laughs> he's we're gonna. gonna bust he's gonna come through that door in two seconds. <laughs> Whatever the delay Hang is. Hang on. We're gonna. Yeah, there's a, there's a slight delay from us going live and when he's gonna see this. And I know for a fact he's watching. Don Morris. Me. 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 Oh. So it probably just caught up. So let's see how fast he comes in this room. I give him a solid 30 seconds. All right, so what's the other questions before I, um, I get hurt I tagged over here? AT, Kevin. Uh, Alex, say, hey, everyone, sorry for coming in late, just getting off work. I love watching y'all's lives. Hey, Alex, thank you so much. We do Appreciate this. Appreciate it. And I know 4 o'clock is probably not the greatest time, but if you miss the lives, uh, they will live on our Facebook page, but we will also upload them on to YouTube. YouTube. Yep. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Awkward. You should see the look that we're getting right now. It's just a mean face looking through a window with a finger pointed, and just yeah. I yeah. we need to have a beard off. I think I think Don beats you. I, I hate to say it. N another subject. Let's keep going down to this thing. <laughs> uh, let's see. Anything else? I don't see. Oh, here we go. Every rod I built has to get passed by Don Morris and Alex Funky to approval for the fish. It's Perfect. not wrong. But hey, let's talk a little bit really quick. Um, we've been super busy. Very. It's been kind of nonstop here. So 
If you have been sending emails, you have been commenting on stuff or sharing stuff. If you want to share more stuff and you want to be featured on our Instagram stories, tag American Tackle in those for Instagram. Facebook goes the same way. Yep. Um, but outside of that, I think that's going to be it for the show today. If we have any more questions, we'll give everybody a little bit more time. Yeah, definitely. 21 people. Hey, everybody. Good to see everybody. Well, it's good to see the lens. Yes. You have to do They're all in the lens. Whatever. I know. Um, I have to say Georgia was fun. Georgia without was digging, time. without it, there is an epic shot because it was 29 degrees. Yes, we mm -hmm. just happened to catch it the week of the first cold front of the year. Oh, so cold. But yeah. we went up a few days before, caught I don't know 50 fish the first day, about 30, 20, and 20. Uh, it was fun. It was a good time. It was cold. I was not prepared at all for how cold it was in Georgia at that time. But I'm really excited about that product. Yes. And we have a bunch of new products. Yes. A lot like, of stuff coming out in the spring, which is cool. And we're going to keep doing these digital catalog releases. So if you want to stay tuned more of that, please sign up for our newsletter. If you yeah. are a part of the newsletter, you are the first ones to get that. So head over to americantackle.us. You'll see a little pop-out slide out. Sign up there. Or you can go to the very bottom of the page in the footer. And it'll say where you can sign up for the newsletter. Just punch your email address and you'll get added to that list. We don't send out a ton of emails. No. And it's usually very specific. We don't hound you. It's information. It's a new release. It's kind of that. Some inventory coming in. Yeah. Some simple stuff. Yeah. Important things. All right, guys. Well, I think that's going to be it for the show. As always, thank you so very much for tuning in to American Tackle Live Question and Answer. Uh, Funky, again, as always, thank you so much for coming in. We had you Not back to back this time. Back to back. So Probably won't see me till January. <laughs> Well, you're going to be going fishing, so you've got, to, you've got to be some busy stuff going on. So, again, guys, thank you so much for joining us. If you have any questions about anything that was in this video, please put it in the comment section, uh, or you can send us a message on Facebook. If you have any questions about product or even ordering, send an email in to Funky. And what was your email again? Alex, A-L-E-X, F-U-N-K-E, at americantackle.us, or feel free to call the office and Don, Mo, myself, Austin. Austin. And if you have a general question, you yeah. can send it to sales at americantackle.us. Yeah. Or if you just need some info, you can just do it at info at americantackle.us. We're here to help. So. We have, there's, there's a ton of different ways that you can access uh, and get some information from us. So, again, as always, thank you so much for joining us, and we'll see you next time. See ya.